welcome back to my YouTube channel. My name is Danica and I'm the Fit Mom Lifestyle on Instagram, LTK, and TikTok. And today I am back with my weekly Lululemon video. So today we have a Lululemon haul and I know I say this almost every video, but I am so excited for these pieces. I've got some new pieces that I've never tried before, some really great fall pieces, some really great colors. I just love this time of year, and I'm so excited about the pieces that I have because I think they are so great. There is not one fail in this video, okay? I love them all, and I've even added more to my cart in other colors because I love some of these items so much and you know that means that they're like really really great so if you love Lululemon make sure to give this video a thumbs up hit the subscribe button and the notification bell I come out with at least one new Lululemon video every single week and let's get into these products because I cannot wait all right, so before I get started with the new items, I wanted to mention what I'm wearing. Today I have on the men's oversized French Terry half zip. I got this a little while ago. I think that's the name. This is in the color Nomad, and this one is in a size medium. For men's items, I usually do a medium or a large if I really want it like oversized and cozy. This one is already naturally kind of oversized, so the medium works really well. I definitely could do a large, but I like the way the medium fits, and I love this Nomad color. This is very fall for me. I actually was just wearing this, and I was holding my Stanley and my phone, and I was like, yeah, we've got like a very neutral theme going on here. <laughs> We're very into this kind of like brownish color. So um, this is what I have on right now. I'm not sure if this is currently available in the men's um, section, but they do have the steady state line that I talked about in a recent video. I will link that in the cards and below. Um, I talked about the hoodie and um, they have a quarter zip or half zip. I forget exactly. But anyway, it looks very, very similar to this. This one is the French Terry on the inside and the steady state is a really cozy fleece. If I didn't already have this, I would get that and I might just buy that one for my husband because then I can borrow it. So I don't know. We'll see. But I really love this. I um, really love the steady state line. They have hoodies, crew necks, and half zips and they're so cute, so cozy. And don't sleep on the men's section because there's some really great stuff for women there as well. And I think you'll love them. So check them out. I'll have this link below. And like I said, if this specific one isn't available, I'll have the steady state. So that's the first thing. And then um, before I get into all the fall stuff, I do want to talk about one summer item. I did get a swimsuit. It was marked down and I just felt like I couldn't pass it up. So the very first item in today's haul is the Waterside V-neck Skimpy One Piece. It says dive in. This one piece swimsuit features a plunging V-neckline and a low back. Um, what does it say? Intended for a BC cup. So soft and light, it feels barely there. This swim fabric is four-way stretch and quick drying. Adjustable straps, built-in shelf bra for added support and coverage. Pockets for optional removable cups. Skimpy fit is high cut in the back, front, and side. So I'm just going to pop up a picture here. I don't really feel comfortable like showing a bikini. I don't know. Um, I'm still not there yet. So I'm just going to have a picture here so you can see. But I actually bought this exact bathing suit at the end of last summer, but I got it in raspberry cream, which was like a um, very kind of similar to lip gloss, a little bit more orangey, if you're familiar. Anyway, I got that and I really liked it, but I felt like it was a little see-through in the bottom because it was a little bit of a lighter color. And when I got that, I said in the video that I thought about I was going to return it. Um, and if they ever came out with it in black or if black ever went on sale, I would get it. And so when I saw this come out in black again, I was like, ooh, I know I like that swimsuit. Um, we'll see if it goes on sale. Basically, it did go on sale, so I grabbed it. I just think this is such a good basic one piece, but it's still really cute and flattering. It's not like, like, I think of like a mom bathing suit where it's just like, you know, not cute. Like, you're just really covered up and it's just not super flattering. This is not that kind of suit. You've got the low kind of v-neck here. It comes up high on the sides and honestly it is pretty cheeky and then it scoops in the back. But like sometimes I want to wear a one piece but I don't want to feel not like cute in it. You know what I mean? I want a little more coverage but I still want to feel good. And I just feel like this is that swimsuit. I think it looks really flattering. It's really cute but it's just a classic black one piece. So 
I just feel like this is something that's going to be really good to have. It's also really cute with like jean shorts when you're just like walking around or you know whatever. We're going to um, an event actually with work so I'm going to be there with colleagues so I was like you know what this actually might be a good bathing suit to wear in case I run into one of my colleagues it's just like a retreat so we probably won't but you know just in case like at least I'm a little bit more covered up so anyway I really like that I've always liked that swimsuit and I just think it's a good one so very excited to have purchased that on sale. Oh, and I didn't mention I get those in a size 8. So I personally um, usually start with a 10 in tops and then bottoms. I usually start with a 6 or an 8 depending on the item. Um, so an 8 is just, it just works really well for me. Um, I think that if you are between sizes, you could definitely go down in the top part. So like say you wear, you know, like a 6 and a 2 or whatever. I think you could do a 4, meet in the middle or something if you're not just like one size across the board so that's my thought on the swimsuit I do think um, it is made for BC cup so if you're a bigger size I think it's great because it does have that built-in shelf bra um, so you know I I think it's a good one so that's the first thing and then I did get I think this is the only other thing that I got on markdown these are the Lululemon high-rise short these are in a size six this is also the eight inch and this is in the color bone the card says when feeling nothing is everything the Lululemon align collection powered by Nulu fabric is so weightless and buttery soft all you feel is your practice our buttery soft Nulu fabric feels weightlessly light and is sweat wicking and four-way stretch added lycra fiber for stretch and shape retention waistband lies flat and won't dig in hidden waistband pocket high rise eight inch length this color is lined for extra comfort and coverage so this is double lined and it is eight inch but here's my little trick with aligns wonder trains whatever I really wanted these in bone but I personally was kind of waiting to see if they'd go on sale they went on sale but they sold out in the six inch very quickly so I bought the eight inch and I plan to get them hemmed so these are the 8 inch aligned biker shorts. They are double lined. Keep that in mind, which is kind of why I wanted them on sale. Because I was like, well, I don't like double lined isn't my favorite. But if it's on sale, like, you know, it makes it a little bit better. And I do really love the lighter colors. I just, I wish they were single lined, but I get it, you know. So anyway, they're just your basic align shorts. I personally do have a few 8 inch aligned shorts. And I used to wear them more. But what I've realized is... I feel like I have a longer torso and shorter legs and honestly sometimes even the six inch shorts shortens my leg like I feel like the four four inches looks best on my body because of my leg length I think four inches makes my legs look like a good length if that makes sense whereas if I'm wearing um, especially the eight inch it just really shortens my leg and even like the six inch like I said sometimes I really do like the six inch align shorts those are my favorite but I've just noticed that the four inch look better because they make my legs look longer it's all about how you perceive it you know what I mean so anyway um yeah these are the eight inch I'll probably hem them to maybe like a five inch or something so really love these you can't go wrong with the line shorts and when I can get them on sale I love to scoop them up and like I said the trick is you can get them in a different length and just get them hemmed for free at Lululemon Okay, the next item I already took the tags off, have worn a couple of times, and I can't believe I didn't have these, but it's because I changed my size preference. So these are the Speed Up High Rise Short 4 inch. I now like to get these in a size 8 and this is in the color black. So the card says, make it a long one. The Speed Up collection features a lightweight waistband and easy access pockets so you can focus on your run, not your gear. Swift fabric is lightweight, four-way stretch, sweat wicking, and quick drying. Liner is lightweight, sweat wicking, and quick drying with added lycra fiber. Continuous draw cord, signature three pocket waistband, high rise, four inch length. Now, I kind of just mentioned like my length preference when it comes to shorts. For the speed ups, for like workouts and stuff, I really like the two and a half inch. I really think that on me, like for workouts, I love for looser shorts, I should say, um, like the two and a half and the three inch. I don't know why. I just, I, that's kind of what I like. And again, I think it has to do with my leg length. Um, so I really like the two and a half inch speed ups for workouts, but sometimes I want a little more coverage if I'm wearing them casually. And I actually took my son to a museum for his birthday a couple weeks ago and I had these shorts. I recently got them in 
and I was like those are the perfect shorts because I didn't want to wear biker shorts I was like I want to wear my speed up four inch shorts so I took the tags off and I wore these to the museum and they were perfect they're sweat wicking they're comfortable they have the built-in liner they're long enough where I have more coverage but yeah I can still like move around and run after him if I need to these are just like the perfect mom shorts in my opinion I I personally think the four inch is great it just gives you that little extra coverage they do have the five inch track that shorts and now now they have is the six inch in speed up shorts they recently came out with that which is kind of cool if you maybe have longer legs or you just like you know a little bit more of a conservative look I just think it's really great that they're doing that so I love the speed up shorts I think they're really flattering um, this is what they look like I know it's so hard to see in black but I just can't believe I didn't purchase these I've recently started liking my shorts in a size 8 and I think that these were just so hard to get my hands on because they're always like they sell out so quick so I didn't have them and I was like oh my gosh I was looking I've been cleaning out my drawers a lot lately and I was like wait I don't have speed up for it shorts in black so I ordered them um, so anyway love these and they are just so flattering in my opinion, so comfortable. They've got that pocket, they've got a draw cord. They're just, they're a good, they're a good short. They're a good one. So I highly recommend if you don't have speed ups, two and a half or four inch. And like I said, I think there's a six inch now. So that's it for bottoms. The rest of these things are tops. I only have one bra. This is new, a newer bra. And I was talking with a couple of you on Instagram and you were asking if I was gonna try it and I was like, it's coming, it's coming. You know, you know I had to try this one. So this is the Wonder Train Strappy Racer Bra in the CD version. It says, focus on every push, press, and hold. This narrow strap bra is intentionally designed with a light feel that lets, that lets you stay hyper mindful. It says, intended to provide light support for a CD cup, Everlux fabric is sweat wicking, quick drying, and highly breathable with a soft brush feel. Added lycra fiber for stretch and shape retention, pockets for optional removable cups. Now, I, of course, got this in black for my first one. I always start with, like, black or white. This is in a size 10, which is my kind of, like, true starting size for tops and bras, and I love this. I already ordered it in white so that's coming soon in a future haul I think this is really really great I have mentioned in multiple videos that I've tried the flow Y bra over and over and it just does not work for me and I'm only like a C cup and the flow Y bra is made for a BC cup and this is made for a CD cup but I just feel like I breastfed my son for a while and the flow Y just doesn't give me enough lift it just doesn't <laughs> doesn't do what I need it to do okay so I've tried to make it work I've tried sizing down I've tried sizing up it just doesn't work for me and this one does so I'm just really excited about it because for me this is kind of like an like an alternate for that um, bra and I think that if you one love Everlux because I love the sweat wicking quality of Everlux and that it's a little bit more durable but two, this one comes in an AB version and a CD version. So if you're like me and you're kind of on the border or maybe you're a bigger cup size, I highly recommend. I really, really like this. So I will say um, it is Everlux, but it almost feels a little bit more brushed to me. Like it's even like a softer Everlux in my opinion. So anyway, here's what it looks like. Um, it does look similar to the flow Y bra in the front. It's just very simple. The Wonder Train um, like bras, a lot of them have this little seam. So just be aware of that. I know some people don't like that little seam there. It doesn't bother me. Um, and I just think the reason that this works better for me is like the double strap. It's, I don't know, it just, it's a little bit more lift. It just lifts a little bit more than the flow Y bra. I think the straps are a little wider. Um, it's two straps all the way through obviously there's a little bit more coverage here I just really like this so I personally intend to wear it casually and maybe for like lifting days at f45 a light like CrossFit day um, walking things like that I haven't worn it yet other than like for try for, for the try on purpose and I really did like it so I am gonna test it out wear it for a workout wear it casually but I did already order it in white because for upon first impression I know I really like it so 
hopefully that helps but I will be testing it out stay tuned for future um, outfits of the week I'm sure I'll include it in there so you guys can see what I think about it after I've like worn it a little bit so really love that really excited about that already ordered that in another color Okay, next we have another new item that I went online to order in another color and it sold out in my size. So clearly you all are loving it as well. And I'm like basically keeping my eye on the site because if it comes back in the colors that I want in my size, I will be scooping it up. This is another good one. So this is the License to Train Tight Fit Tank. I get this in a size 10 and this is in heathered medium forest i believe it says the key to crushing your gym goals is to train without distractions this soft fitted top stays out of your way so you can keep the reps coming fabric is four-way stretch sweat wicking and quick drying added like a fiber for stretch and shape retention this garment was treated with no stink sink to inhibit the growth of odor causing bacteria on the fabric side cinch details keeps the fit close and moves with you tight fit waist length now so many good things about this first of all i love the cinching i think it is so flattering personally i think in this color it looks more like a workout top but the other one that i want is heathered black which i think also looks kind of like workout like a workout top but then they also have like a heathered is it heathered bone heathered ivory something like that there's like a heathered white one which i think you could dress up a little bit more um and wear outside the gym obviously these look great for athleisure but i just think that heathered white one looks a little bit dressier so i love the side cinch um i've talked about that with the all it takes shirts i personally like my stomach is not my favorite area I carry a lot of weight there um, or not a lot but like that's where I hold my fat and um, I think the side cinch just really makes that like it's just very flattering on that area I also don't have like very wide hips or anything I just think it it really looks good um, especially if you have more of a square body type like me or maybe your stomach area isn't your favorite that side cinch just it's really really good i think if you you know I, I encourage you to try it if you're like i don't wear crop things try it with the side cinch it might change your mind um they also do have this in like a regular tank if you don't like the cropped like cinch it just kind of is like flowy so i'll have that one linked down below if you're interested maybe you don't wear crop stuff or like if you're pregnant or postpartum that one would be really great because it's a little bit flowier um but it's it's really cute too and so my husband has the license to train shorts and he's always loved those so then they started coming out with license to train for women they came out with the shorts they came out with the joggers now they've got these tanks um and i just really like it i really like this line um i do like that it's the no stink zinc as well i also like that it's tight to the body like it was saying sometimes when i'm doing certain workouts i want a tank that's tight to my body i don't want to worry about it like flowing around i don't wear a lot of my flowy tanks or i haven't worn them a lot lately because i personally prefer something fitting closer to the body lately but I like that this isn't so tight that it's like suffocating you or squeezing you in the wrong ways. It's just very flattering. It's tight to the body, but it lays on the body, if that makes sense. So I just think it's very flattering and I really like it. So I have been loving the medium forest and dark forest. So I had to get this. I have some like the wonder trains and stuff in medium forest. So I thought this would be good with that. Obviously it would look great with black too. I really like the heathered fabric whenever it's heathered too it's always just like a little bit softer so i think this is such a cute flattering tank i love how it fits it's like pretty simple as well but like i said i would really like to get it in a couple more colors but unfortunately they're sold out in my size so if they have this in your size i recommend grabbing it i think this is a really really great one again i think this will look really great for workouts and be very functional for workouts but it's also cute for athleisure and like I said I mean you could probably even dress this one up with like jeans and a jacket honestly you could if, if you try you could dress up anything okay I'm convinced I love dressing up Lululemon I love finding ways to wear Lululemon all the time so love that highly recommend it's a good one um okay now I have a couple 
I have one more shirt, which I have already talked about, and then the next few items are all new. So this one I have in another color already, but let's get into it. This is the Hold Tight Cropped T-shirt, again in a size 10. This one is in Dark Forest. I'm telling you, the Forest, Medium Forest and Dark Forest are my colors for fall. Summer was lip gloss. The Forest line is my thing for fall. Like if it comes out in Forest, I'm like, I need it obviously I need it because I love this color so it says this lightweight everyday top has just the right softness just the right stretch and a snug fit that feels like a second skin model fabric is soft and naturally breathable tight fit cropped length fabric is dry from responsibly sourced wood based materials now I have to say I was doing the try on trying on all these things and I put this on and I was like ah feels so cozy like I really feel like I could sleep in this shirt it is so comfortable we're going on a trip soon and when I put this on I was like I need to pack this like this is coming with me it's just so good it's so comfortable I personally have talked about how I had a problem with the long sleeve because I felt like it was just too tight the arms were too tight but I love the short sleeve I think it's perfect I love that it's a little bit longer I think it's flattering it's so soft it's so comfy the whole tight line is like the coziest fabric it but it's so cute and flattering and I just really really like this obviously I love this color but this is just such a good comfy shirt sometimes the cropped t-shirts like this are just not like they're really cute and flattering but they're not like something that you want to put on they're not like the most comfortable this is so comfortable so really love this I plan to bring this for our trip like I said I'll probably wear it with the soft stream pants in black or um, the groove pants I think those would look really cute with this for just kind of a casual outfit so love that again I mean I, I know I keep saying love that highly recommend but I am so happy with all of the pieces in this haul so now let's get into some jackets all right, so I have a few jackets that I'm really excited to share with you. Actually, as you're watching this video, we will be in the Midwest. We're going to Purdue. My husband went to school there, and it's their homecoming game, so we're going for that, and then we're going to make our way up to Chicago. As you're watching this, we're probably driving to Chicago. Um, so we are going to be in the Midwest, and it's going to be a little bit colder, not, not like super cold yet, but... A little bit colder and I we bought these jackets like just for the fall but when I was trying them on and I was showing my husband and stuff I'm like we need to bring these like these are awesome we're bringing these for our trip so this first one I am really pleasantly surprised with I have to be honest when this came in the mail I was like mm, I don't know if I'm gonna like this I'm probably gonna send it back and then I put it on and I was like uh no does it come in other colors I really do like this one so this is the Define Relaxed Fit Jacket in Luan. And I saw this come out and I was like, ooh, that's cool. I like oversized flowy things and I like the Define Jacket, but I just, I, I mean, I'm wearing a men's, you know, sweatshirt. I like things bigger and cozier. So when I saw this come out, I was like, that's interesting. And of course it comes in the dark forest and I'm like, I think I need dark forest too. I don't, but if it goes on sale, I might. Anyway this is a really cool jacket so it's i got this in a size 10 in the color black the card says a fan favorite redefined we added lightweight swift fabric to our defined jacket to create a relaxed silhouette with plenty of volume our cottony soft luon fabric is supportive sweat wicking and four-way stretch added like a fiber for stretch and shape retention swift fabric on back and sleeves is lightweight sweat wicking and quick drying thumb holes and cuff ins, secure front pockets with a hidden phone sleeve, cinch the shock cords at the hem to adjust the shape, relax, fit, hip length. Now, this is a little bit oversized and I feel like you could definitely size down. I could definitely get this in a size eight, but I just got the black. I figured it's gonna be a little oversized. It's meant to be oversized, so that's fine. I love this. I really love this. It's like a bomber jacket, but Lululemon version. I, I feel like it's got that bomber jacket kind of vibe, but then it's got the collar. I just think this is so cool, and I love that it's black and gold. Also, the Purdue's colors are black and black and gold, and so I'm like, wait, I might wear this to the game. Throw on a Purdue hat, and I'm good to go, you know? So anyway, um, 
I really like this. It is Luan. So the first thing I thought when I pulled this out of the bag was like, ooh, I wonder if they're going to come out with this in Nulu because this would also be super nice in Nulu. And I think if they came out with it in Nulu, I would want that instead. Personally, I like Luan, but I just feel like, you know, this might be, if this part was Nulu, it would be even like softer and more comfy. But then, like it said, you can kind of see, I know it's hard to tell with black, but you can kind of see the fabric difference that this is like a Swift fabric. Do you see how the fabric changes? So it's like Luan here, Swift fabric on the arms, and then the back here is Luan which is really nice and then swift fabric here so it is a lighter weight jacket it's not like something that you would wear if it's super cold outside but i do think for this time of year it's going to be really great i love the gold accents and i wear a lot of gold jewelry so i think it looks really cute with like the gold accents and then my gold jewelry it does have the gold lululemon logo here on the back i have a define jacket in dark red it was like the lunar new year one and that one has gold accents and i just really like that look and like i said this comes in the dark forest with the gold oh, it's really beautiful too but i just thought black would be so classic and then like it said there are the shop cords so you can tighten it i did tighten it because like i said i got a 10 if i had gotten like maybe an eight i could probably even get a six honestly um, I might not need to tighten it as much, but I, I like it. And then if I have it tucked, I can kind of just like, or I can just kind of tuck it under. I also think it looks really cute open, but I do like it kind of bigger like this because I could even throw a sweatshirt on under if I wanted to. So you definitely have some flexibility with this as far as sizing goes. You could size down. I just think this is really cool. It's definitely not a necessity. Um, I just think it's a cool, unique piece that Lululemon came out with and I really like it so um, I think that's a fun one and I'm happy that I got it and I'm not sending it back so love that so next I talked about the steady state line a little bit earlier um, I recently got the hoodie and I actually decided to exchange it because I got it in a medium and I decided I like the large better again I was talking about earlier how I just like things a little bit more oversized also what's nice is my husband and i are kind of like we could share basically we're we're close enough in size that we could share and i had him try the medium on and he's like oh i think i want the large i was like fine i'll get the large and we could just share it so i decided to get that one in the large and i just kind of decided that if i get anything in the steady state line i personally want it in a large because it's a little bit more oversized a little bit more cozy and i can share it with my husband so when it comes to the steady state, I don't think it's like super oversized. So I think you can go true to size or size up depending on how you want it to fit. So I got another steady, steady state item and I got it in a large. So this is the steady state half zip in a size large in the color black. It says a reimagined classic. This fleece half zip puts softness first so you can bring comfort wherever you go. Blended cotton fleece fabric is naturally breathable, soft against your skin, and provides warmth. Oh, it does say oversized fit. So I guess it is technically an oversized fit, but I personally don't think it's that oversized. So, I mean, it is in a large, but you know what I mean. So I actually don't own a scuba funnel neck in black. I own a scuba half zip and a scuba full zip in black, but I don't own a scuba funnel neck in black. And I kind of wanted, like I thought about getting it, but I was like, uh, like they come out with so many black jackets. Like, let me just see what else they come out with in black. And they came out with the black, um, like basically a similar half zip last year in the men's version, but it was like a fleece. And I actually got it in a couple of other colors because they went on sale. So whenever they went on sale, I ended up picking them up. Um, and I was kind of waiting for the black to go on sale. When the black finally went on sale, it was sold out in my size. So I never got my hands on the black fleece and I don't own like a black funnel neck, like I said. So anyway, when I saw them come out with this steady state line, I was like, I think this is my opportunity to get a black funnel neck because I've kind of been like on the hunt for it but I wanted I just wanted something different so I really like this it is just like a classic um half zip but it's really cozy I love the fleece I think it's just it's just it's a good basic basically um can you get this cheaper elsewhere definitely um I don't think there's anything super unique or special about it but I just really like it. I think it's cozy. I think it's cute. I've been wanting something like this from Lululemon. So 
you so I mean you could honestly find a dupe on Amazon if you wanted but I just really like this one and I think the steady state line is so great and I highly recommend um so yeah this is what it looks like it's just your very basic um half zip and let me just quickly show you the fleece on the inside obviously i'm wearing a half zip very very similar to this but this one is really nice and fleecy i like that it's cozy and warm but it's not too thick it's less it's not as thick as like the scubas for example it's pretty it's like a thinner fleece so really really like this again i know it's overpriced for what it is but it's just a good basic and a classic that i will have for years and i think it's really great so really love that and then the last jacket that i have is actually not mine but like i said my husband and i are similar sizes so we can kind of share things so this is called the outpour jacket and it is from the men's line and my husband got it in a large this is a little bit more of a pricier jacket but this is something that he was really excited about because he thought he could dress this up or dress this down my husband um works he basically wears a suit to work every day and so he was thinking this is nice enough that he could wear over his suit but it's also something that he could wear to the gym so he really liked the versatility of this it's black it's basic and he figured he would just wear this for years he keeps his things for years and years and wears them to the ground so he thought this was a really good investment piece and i agree i think it's really great i tried it on it is a little oversized on me it is a men's large but it's like in a pinch I could definitely wear this or if I wanted something oversized like I could definitely wear this so um, if, if you wanted to buy this I think you could size down or go true to size I guess if I were getting it myself I'd get a men's medium and that would be perfect so um, it, it is a little bit bigger though and oversized so let's look at the card it says waterproof seam sealed ventilation it says keep your rainy day motivation strong designed for movement this waterproof jacket is made from two-way stretch fabric and has integrated ventilation for quick cool downs breathable windproof and waterproof stretch seal fabric is two-way stretch and seam sealed to keep you dry back vent place to provide airflow underarm vents zippered exterior pockets with a hidden phone sleeve drop-in chest pocket cinchable hood cinchable hem adjustable cup cuffs reflective detail classic fit hip length so i feel like they definitely have like a lot going on this is a really good jacket i know the color is like kind of blown out because i keep showing black items but i think this looks really nice like this would totally look nice with a suit like we were saying it's got this little pocket here in the front um if you can see that there it's got the big hood it's got kind of like the flap here which is really nice i know it's hard to see but it's just a really nice hood it's just like a really clean sharp looking jacket i feel like my grandma when i say the word sharp it's sharp um it's got this little vent here in the back and it's just really really nice it's got uh pockets here on the side and just something that could definitely be dressed up i don't even see the lululemon logo i'm trying to find it but i don't even see there's like no branding really and then it does have the reflective details on the sleeves so um i don't know what those buttons are for can you fold it over Oh, I guess maybe you can button it tighter. Yeah. Okay, so I guess you can button it tighter. That's cool. Okay, there's so many, like, bells and whistles on this jacket. I'm, like, discovering new things as I look at it with you. So I'm trying to – oh, here it is. So I'm trying to find the Lululemon logo. It's on the left hip. So that's all that there is. So definitely not – not not very much branding or anything and just a really nice basic jacket for yourself or maybe a man in your life all right so that is it for today's lululemon haul i hope that you enjoyed this video and if you did please make sure to give it a thumbs up let me know down below what your favorite item from this haul was i kind of feel like i had a pretty good variety in today's haul and like i said i think these are all really great pieces i highly recommend i think you would love anything from this haul thank you so much for watching i appreciate you so so much and i'll see you in my next video